This is your Livingston County real estate market update. And in this video, I'm gonna share with you something that's really interesting compared to maybe what you're seeing uh, in the marketplace. Hey guys, it's John Wentworth, owner operator, Wentworth Real Estate Group. Uh, and as I said, and I'm gonna share this with you right away because this is the thing that people are always talking about right now. Well, there's two things, interest rates and inventory. Let's talk about the inventory because I know as a consumer, uh, people are feeling like, man, there's just nothing for sale. But when we look at the data, the number of pending home sales in Livingston County right now, uh, today's uh, March 14th. So when we look at the number of homes pending right now, year to date inside of 2022, it's only down, uh, let's see, 3%. 323 homes were pending last year on this day and 313 are pending today. So the actual, the number of homes selling is pretty much on par. Uh, and so I think what you're going to see is by the time we get through the first quarter of 2022, almost the same number of homes are going to have closed and sold as they did in 2021. The difference is the days on the market continues to decline. So again, days on market for Livingston County down about 13%. So as a consumer, you know, it feels like there's nothing for sale, but the same number of homes are selling, they're just selling so quickly. Uh, that you have to be prepared when you enter this market. There's no doubt about that. Uh, average sales price for Livingston County is up just over 10%, and uh, which is 385,000. The number of new listings uh, coming to the market is actually uh, up 1%. So again, the same number of homes are selling. The same inventory is essentially out there. We look at uh, price per square foot in Livingston County, that's up just shy of 12%. The average price per square foot for Livingston County uh, as of today is $188 per square foot. Um, let's talk about interest rates real quick and then uh, let you guys go. Interest rates, again, people are talking about the interest rates. They have spiked up a little bit, but when you break, break it down and you do the math on it, it's, it's been a change of about $20 in your monthly payment per 100,000. So if you're looking to spend $500,000, your payment's going to be about $100 more. So not a big change, not enough to slow down um, what's going on inside of our market. Uh, well, from what we're seeing inside of our business, uh, we just, uh, February is our, uh, a great month for us. March, we're, on, we're already uh, trending to have our best month ever in March. So again, the real estate market is very strong. I believe it's going to stay strong. I don't think that these things that, that we're hearing out there are really having much of an impact on our market at all. So happy selling uh, in 2022. Obviously, if you're thinking of making a move, we'd love the opportunity to serve you.